The time has come for this cookie! Hi guys, this is Cookie coming to you from Kingdom 417 and this video is going to be based on player feedback that was collected for the developers to make slight changes towards this game. The feedback are submitted for the developers to go over and you'll see here in the video that some of the ideas were accepted, some were put on hold and some was put towards the future. Here we looking at the Clash of Kings community page on Facebook. Here you would find the guides that are written by the players and the developers. Since this is a worldwide game, there's different languages needed for the translations of each guide. And here are all the different languages and you can just simply click on the link to take you towards your language. This clip is basically the developers taking your information and then the response towards it. To the left, you'll see that the feedback was recorded into the center you see the number of times this feedback was constantly mentioned and to the far right you see that the developers response towards this exact feedback you will see here that some of the developers have accepted the ideas put the idea in the future or was put on hold for near future this is one form of document that is used to gather the information that's needed to change the game based on the number of players and the information gathered please take note that when Gathering this form of information and implement it takes time, so it may not happen within a week, but then you can expect one of your ideas you suggested to come out in the near future. Here we'll be looking at the world dominations optimizations. The same way I have shown you on the player feedback collection, it was implemented in the happy domination as well. Quality of life improvements were added into this as well. And here's the first one, rallies showing up in your chat. This was not showing up at first, but since then it has been added because of the player feedback. Another quality of life for improving this system was when you joined a match and the other team did not show up, your entire team could not gain points. Now this change will help all players on that team who showed up to gain points. At the same time, there were times when your captain was not online to sign you up for your team. Now you had an assistant captain who is capable of doing the same thing. Part 4 for the optimization for the world domination was the thumbnails. Thumbnails allowed the players to see what's going on with the map so you can plan out your strategies with your teammates. Part 5 of the optimization for this was because this is a worldwide game and many players were not able to join the event because at the time frame of which the event started so they broke down the time frame to many matches in a single day so that all time zones can join in. Capturing elements was one way of improving the game because if you were not able to remove the enemy from a specific location, capture the elements for the additional stats and then you can try again and see if that worked. Sending out march cues and at the same time developing the technology will greatly help your team on winning the match.